Hi, welcome back to Leslie Crafts. Today I'm going to show you a quick little project you can do by using two of the items from add on kits of um, the kit this month, which are the little flare buttons and the little crepe rosettes. And this is one idea I have done. So it's like a little rosette ribbon. So I just thought these are nice and quick and they're quite good for putting on cards, um, boxes, um, bag toppers. Uh, these will go really well with bag toppers. I haven't got any. I can show you, yeah, I can show you a back of something I'm working on. Obviously it doesn't go with the paper, but just to give you an idea of a bag topper. So that will go in quite nicely on there. So yeah, so just to give you a few ideas. So all I've got extra is some card shapes and I've used the punch from Stampin' Up, which is this one here. Um, I don't know how well, I don't know even if it's, it's still in stock, but that's the punch I'm using. And I've just cut out um, three yellows and um, two greens. I would obviously have I would use one just to show you. And then I've got a selection of the um, colours. And then I've got some words. And then I've got the flares. So, and then I've got the hot glue here. So, there's several ways you can do this. So I'm just going to use the hot glue on there and then put the rabbit on. You get nine flares in the pack and the packs are two pound. And then you get 30 rosettes and again they're two pound. So you can just leave it like that um, and that's cute. Or you can take it one step further and put it on here. And then you can just have some glue on there we'll put that back in this holster and then just have your word on there if your word comes in your kits and then that's a lovely little embellishment as well so that is that there and then obviously there's that one there so both are you know useful just to have in your stash and how I did that one was I just got some scraps of paper and I just cut two strips so and then two of these so and then just to make two banners and then I'm just gonna put them up on there and then I'm just gonna staple this together staple uh, is playing up I think he's had enough of me stapling this is sure now two staples at a time now and again just grab some hot glue it's just easy for me to keep it in the holster Put that on there, and take the flare, put it on there. So I might go out at half past three because my son's school's just phoned up. Luckily he's got his brother there because he's just been told to take his cap off and he doesn't do kindly for that. It's obviously a big school, new rules. So that is the two little prize rosettes that you can do so I quite like both ways really um, you know so it goes on there and then I'm going to do the little foxy on there and then I'm going to have is Thing on there, oops, there we go, a bit too much glue, 
and then I'm just going to put that underneath there. Oops, got quite a bit of glue on there, but that's fine. It will dry. So that's another one there, same paws and claws. And then we'll do another one with the banner bits. So it goes on there. So yeah. So getting the little one to school tomorrow might be a little bit more challenging. Um, because obviously secondary school is a little bit stricter than primary and it was told to take his hat off which in the grand scheme of things it's not a problem but um, David's got autism and he takes everything as being told off if it's from a stranger and because he's not too sure about his teachers and the rules he gets a bit upset luckily my eldest my well his middle his middle sibling was is still there and managed to calm down the situation before he got really out of hand which is quite good so you always worry don't you and then there's that one. So like I say, these were just really quick little embellishments. I thought I'd just show you how to do with your add-on kits, just in case. And then over the next couple of videos, I'll be showing you what I'm going to be doing with these. And um, yeah, so and again, these will be up on my Facebook group. These might be up sooner than the video or I might try and coincide it when the video goes out if I'm really that organised and um, yeah so thanks for watching and um, like I say this was a nice quick video and um, yeah and photographs will be up on my Facebook group okay thank you for watching bye